He said, fuck that level. <laughs> so enormous that it's hard to comprehend trouble. Ah, yes. I didn't know we were speaking of my dick. <laughs> Should we? Let me see the controller. Oh, yeah, go for it. Um. Ah, buddy. <laughs> the loading screens are the slowest part of this. I hate it. But <laughs> you had a story to tell. Okay, well, it's not as much. Well, actually, I can tell a story about what happened in German class today. Oh, yes. Tell of your German exploits. All right. Now, I'm in high, I'm in high school, so we're kind of stupid as fuck. <laughs> And, uh, okay, not kind of, we're mostly stupid as fuck. Um, so we were in German class, and, like, most of the kids were taking the national German exam. I was not, because I didn't sign up for it, because I didn't want to pay money. And so, like, my teacher assigned us, like, this assignment where we had to record something. We were given a script, we had to fill it in, in German, and then record it. Mm -hmm. But <laughs> she gave us a bunch of props, and, uh, first what I did is I grabbed the coconuts, and like, but they were plastic and they were in two pieces. And I put them over my boobs. <laughs> well, I put them over my nips. And uh, like this guy who's taking the test just stared at me <laughs> with a blank face and just kind of started laughing to himself. Why, my friend? And uh, then I got these like circular glasses. Who were, like, they didn't work. But I took off my glasses and put them on. I couldn't fucking see, but I started staring at people taking the test. <laughs> Then I had, then we actually came to recording, and my uh, partner Liam, he got really angry at me when he was like, "What do you mean you weren't like listening to your lines? You didn't learn them?" I was like, "I was busy staring at people." <laughs> I was fucking around. No, it's uh, I get that feeling a lot. Like whenever I, I forget to do something I'm supposed to, someone's like, "What were you doing instead?" I was like, "Eh, I was uh, I, I think I was like." Trying to eat a raw chicken breast without chewing. Or, so just swallowing it? Yeah, just trying to swallow a chicken breast whole or like throwing garbage at strangers. Stuff like that. Yeah. Stuff I do in my I remember there was like a stupid like way to open up the secret lair. Uh, you have to like go to Mermaid Man's chair. There we go. I, oh, don't skip this cutscene. I want to see it. Is this, oh, this is as stupid as I remember it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm glad that happened. <laughs> oh, me too. I love it. <laughs> this game is uh, it's great A animation. <laughs> oh, it's like a plate of spaghetti. Oh, remember this level, Robbie? Remember how fun it oh, was? It's totally fun. You shouldn't stick. Uh. <laughs> Uh, uh, fish dicks. This. Don't step on the red squares of the disco floor. Okay, how, how can much I just... you know about South Park, my dude? Uh, it's very debatable what I know. Do you do you know that um, the uh the um, the Kanye West joke? Fish sticks. Yeah, that one. Yeah. That just reminded me of that because they said fish sticks and now I can't. Oh, uh, wait, wait. Oh no, not this guy. Oh, I hate this guy. Uh, I don't remember what he does. He's a dog cowboy. You have to throw your uh, ball at him, and the dogs explode into shit clouds. Oh, look at that. They and then he throws out more dogs out of his doghouse. So you gotta use your bowl on him and then uh, bowl his dogs. Roll in, roll in, Named roll in. Arf, use the bubble ball to defeat him. Keep them doggies rolling, 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 rolling. Keep them doggies rolling. Oh, I think I finally see the difficulty here, because they get in the way. Yeah. You get, you gotta use some MLG snipe skills, and then he moves. Okay. Um. Maybe you can get in close. Maybe I can just leave. <laughs> yeah, I think you can just ignore him. Wait. Maybe I can just Ooh, snipe him from high ground. Don't do it, Anna. Can I have the high ground? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I just imagine that's Anakin like flipping. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do it. Uh, Don't do it, Anakin. Except the funny thing is, I like that movie. <laughs> <laughs> and it's the best out of the prequels, I'm sure. It. 
Well, you're sure? Or have you seen it? Yeah. It does Shh, pretty. Don't quiz me on Star Wars shit. It... I love Star Wars. I love Star Wars too, but the prequels. I love stars. I love wars. I remember this was one of the stupid parts. Uh, try hitting the other way, because it looks like it's all blocked up there. there oh shit, you're so smart. Oh yeah. So smart. I'm a fucking PhD. In what? Kicking your butt? I got a PhD in... Kicking your ass. Eating pussy. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, what? that's what that did. It's just, it, it reveals the invisible Boto Mobo. I think that was just a little like Easter egg. Subtle tutorial. Yeah, I guess the the purpose that would serve in game design would be to demonstrate the fact that you can do things. This, yeah, that you can use the bubble ball to activate that switch before you actually like have to do it. But then like the use of the tutorial sign showing you exactly what you just learned implicitly and making it explicit. Okay. Kind of ruins. Let me let me stop you there. All right. You said a lot of big words that I wasn't listening to cuz I was playing the game. That's fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's my entire point. Ah, uh, yes. Oh yeah, Otherwise. we got our we got our first comment from someone I didn't know. We get comments all the time. We do? Mhm. Mm oh, I don't see them cuz my uh, YouTube account isn't really connected to ours. Yeah. But I responded to them. And I don't remember what I said. I was like, I think I said, thank you, friendo. Edward. Yes. <laughs> Wonderful. Um, also, if you if you ever see me comment anything, if you're wondering what my picture is, it's a picture of Lanny Pator from, like, his, uh, that video that they put up on April Fool's. I was supposed to be Broly, but it was just Digimon. But at the end, he was, like, he tied up two of his co-workers <laughs> and was, like, pouring gasoline on the floor, and it just zooms in on his face. So I just screenshotted that, and I just edited it and turned out the saturation. <laughs> it's pretty, it's a pretty great picture. I'll have to show it to you. Nice. Oh, hey, look, it's... Oh, you can How do this. How Squidwang? How... How... How'd he... If you're ever... If I comment with my person there and you're ever wondering where my picture is, it's a lamppost. It's a sexy... It's a sexy thought, man. It used to be out in my front yard, but then got blown down when a hurricane hit our state. And it's Wait, been, when was it? Uh, you remember Hurricane Matthew when yeah. it came through? Yeah. How... Yeah. That, that's when that happened. It blew out the uh, lamppost. It was a little sad because the lamppost has been there since 1968. But You know what was fucking bullshit? What? I was at my girlfriend's house during most of that. And uh, the first thing that happened before the power went off, the fucking uh, internet went out. Ah, yes. And then like an hour later, the power went out. <laughs> when I... When I, I, um, I woke up uh, with the power out. Because it was like a Saturday, it can't be expected to be up before like 3. Uh, so I woke up and the power was already out. And I'm like, damn it, it's all dark. And I like go downstairs looking for people. And then no one's in the house. I look at my phone and there's texts from my mom saying, Hey, we've evacuated to, um, to your grandparents' house. Like, okay, so... So, how did so, you get there? Well, uh, they just, they just drove over. Because, uh, our neighborhood was only partially blocked. Oh, yeah, the tree. Of, yeah, yeah, you remember that. Yeah. Fun fact, we're neighbors. Yeah, I live, like, two doors down. <laughs> yep. And we sandwich an old man with our, with our house. An it's, old horde man. He has a lot of shit. He does, I mean... I mow his lawn, and he's like, like two years ago, um, he's like, hey, you can have my car. What? What, what are you talking about? It's like, yeah, that, um, that old sob I have in the driveway, if you can clean it out, you can have that car. Are you gonna I'm take like, it? Most likely not, because it seems like it'll have, um, it'll be one of those that, like, the repair costs are going to be way higher than, uh, than, like, actually just getting a, a pre-owned yeah. something or other. And, um, yeah. 
it, it never runs. It's just been sitting there with like. Oh yeah, it's fucking broken, dude. Yeah, most likely. You gotta go activate some black debate. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. <laughs> Me either. But it just it seems like it, the repair costs would be way more than than necessary. Yeah, but you I'm know just... what? Yeah. Cars. <laughs> it cars, yes, indeed. So I'm probably just gonna get like. I, I really want to get, like, an old Japanese car, because those things run forever. I mean, yeah, but still. Yeah. You just, just, well, I, I just want, want a car. <laughs> right. I don't want, like, a really great car. I just want something that I won't have to pay more than, than like, an actual, like, new fucking car. You want a car that will get you some puss. I mean... That yeah. goes without saying, though. Right. Well, just having a car in general, it's not like I, I need a lot of help in that department. Ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies. You turn into Mung. Yes. I love that fucking show. All I gotta do is say, hey, I played bass. And then, like, and oh. then they'll be like, but you're not black. And you're just gonna... <laughs> 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 Uh, have you seen, um, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia? No. Oh my god. It's the best show. Jesse like, just referenced it yesterday, and I was like, I haven't seen that show. Ah, uh, you should watch it. It's the best. I, I probably know. should, but... You should. Um, shit. No. There was, uh, one episode where they, like, they go to a, a doctor who lives in, like, a gardener shed. He's named Dr. Jinx. Uh-huh. And, uh, <laughs> he's this, uh... He's this black guy with a bunch of plants around. Yeah. And he's like, they're like going to the doctor to see if they can cure somebody's cancer. And like, he's like, oh yeah, I can cure your cancer for $10,000. <laughs> and then they're like, um, one of them is like, hey, do you have anything that can cure my eczema? He like pulls up his sleeve and uh, it's just a terrible rash and he sprays some miracle grow on it. <laughs> <laughs> and, um,. Uh, one of the other guys, he's like, do you have anything that can make me feel again? Do you have anything for feelings? He's, oh yeah, Dr. Jinx has something for feelings. And he brings out like a low-tone <laughs> funk bass. <laughs> and, <he> starts, <laughs> <laughs> and just like staring directly in his eyes the whole time. Oh my god. I fucking love it. And it's some tasty, like, wet, meaty bass lines. <laughs> Was this like an old black guy? Hey, he wasn't that old. Was he a black guy? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Good. he was a black guy just, like, uh, doing some, uh, <laughs> some soul shit. Just funky. Can you make me feel good? I have a doctor who can do that. His name is Dr. Feel Good. <laughs> oh, doctor, I need is feel good. <laughs> I love uh... <laughs> We are bio men. We are bio men. The Cybermen. We are bio men. Oh, we talk about Dragon Ball so fucking much on this show. Jesse just got a new Dragon Ball jacket. Oh, nice. Nice poise walk. Can I? Sure said. Oh, shit, I have to use Patrick here. Do you... Oh, it's this bullshit. You have to get the thing over here, and it's, like, the worst. Because oh. it takes hours. Oh. You know, remember what I was talking about? You know what I mean? I think so, yeah. No, I'm with the thrust group. I was going off on some tangent, and I can't remember what I was doing. Like, right now? Uh, earlier. Oh. I forgot it. If it was important, I would remember, but I don't, so... So it probably wasn't important? Probably. I mean... Most likely not. Most things I say on the show aren't, aren't that important. I'm... I'm... This, this level is gonna kill me. I just came here because I know, like, for a fact, at first they're gonna be a few easy ones, easy pa spatulas, spatus. Yeah. Yeah. There's like the one for just moving along. I want to get later in this level because um, the computer's voice actor is like, I think I recognize it. What the fuck? What? I made it. What? <laughs> How did? I think I recognize the computer's voice actor, but I need to hear it again to really. Uh, recognize. Damn it. I, that was my fault. <laughs> I got the hiccups. They don't my breath. 
Oh no, Rob has got the hiccup. It means you've been sucking too much penis. <laughs> ah yes, that'll do it. I've like trained myself to very rarely get the hiccups, and when I do, it's go on. <laughs> when I do, I like have this instant mechanism to like if I hold my breath for like three seconds, I can shut it off. Um, cause whenever I I used to get hiccups, uh, my dad had a habit of um of trying to scare them out of me. And that was his tactic. Whenever someone got hiccups, it's like his excuse to say some wild shit to just spook you out of it. I was like, I remember I got hiccups one time. Um, while I was real little. And he's like, if you don't clean up your room in 10 seconds, I'm going to take away your DS for a year. What? Yeah, that's actually a pretty good impression of your dad. <laughs> what was it? Yeah. I don't... For a year. For a year. Whoa, okay, what? I'm like crying, running around. I want my DS, thank you! I'm throwing pillows all over the place. <laughs> and then, like, 10 seconds later, I actually get a lot of stuff cleaned up. I'm like, please don't take my DS. And he's like, well, your hiccups are gone, aren't they? You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. You've butt. done this. I've never had a prolonged case of hiccups after that. <laughs> How are you supposed to do this? Um. Blood, sweat, and tears. Mm. I got the sweat part down. It's called not stopping. <laughs> oh shit, we've been going for 16 minutes. Oh shit. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna see everybody next episode. Hopefully, finish this. Yeah, I hope. Bye.